Hey guys, it's Dallas with Nexus 5 Soft Modder. Today we're going to check out some of the features and apps from the Nokia X that you can bring to your Nexus 5. Now there's a flashable zip that will give you a lot of the sound files, stuff like uh, ringtones, notifications, alarms, uh, lock and unlock sounds, and it'll integrate them right into your Nexus 5's existing settings. For more on that, uh, check out the link below for the full tutorial, of course. But we'll check those out nonetheless. Here we got some sounds. Uh, the ringtone, for instance, I bet you recognize this one. Good old Nokia, right? And we also got some apps for you. There's a uh, actual Nokia only app store, something they maintain separately from Google Play. Um, but unfortunately for us with the Nexus 5, we can't install any of their apps. Uh, it kind of just crashes at that point. We can, however, check the store itself out just to see how the other side lives. And uh, right off the bat, you notice a Nokia-esque black simple icons interface. Um, pretty much like a uh, Play Store, you go in, it gives you the description. Nothing groundbreaking here, really. But like I said, you can't install any of these apps. Just worth checking out. Their file browser here is pretty standard. Let you let you poke around, let you open uh, files, but unfortunately you can't cut, copy, paste, or delete any files. So it's not really a daily driver in that regard. Their web browser is actually a little bit different. From the home screen you can see they have a lot of bookmarks already set up for you and strangely enough the address slash search bar is on the bottom. There's a little task switcher interface um, that has a familiar swipe gesture from other Android browsers. The gallery app is a little bit of a what you see is what you get kind of thing. You open up folders, you look at pictures, and that's about all you can do with it. There's no editing features or anything of that sort. The camera on the other hand does have some interesting features that are unique to this um, app. Let's go ahead and check those out, will we? So right here on the bottom right you got the settings icon which shows you some things that we don't have on our Nexus 5 by default. That's not it, there it is. Anti-banding, noise reduction, and red eye reduction. These are unique features. There's also some uh, color presets basically that you can uh, put in, change the picture before you even take it. There's also a panoramic and a video mode, however the video mode does crash when you open it up. Panoramic works pretty well. But again, pretty standard stuff really. And like I said, for further information you can go ahead and check out our full tutorial down in the uh, description below. And of course try to like, comment, or subscribe. And we'd appreciate it. We'll see you next time. Thanks a lot. Bye bye.